Hello, my name's Philip, and I'm a developer here at Ashley Audio. In this video, we're going to be covering duplication of controls. In order to duplicate a control, you must first be in edit mode. Currently, my app is in edit mode, and so I can just get started with the duplication. First, I'll need to select a control by touching it. Now I can see that control is selected because it has a border um, in the background. And I also notice that these buttons have become highlighted. Uh, now that I have a control selected, these buttons actually have a use. So um, I, I notice here there's a duplication button. This is the button we want to use to duplicate a control. When I touch the duplicate button, I'll notice that a second control was added. Um, and it is now highlighted, but the previous control is no longer selected. This control will have um, this duplicated control will have all of the settings of the previous control. Notice how it looks exactly the same. Um, whatever other properties have been set in that control, they'll be duplicated as well. So this is a really quick way um, to, you know, to speed your design along if you're uh, trying to create multiple controls after you've already configured one. Um, another uh, thing that you can do is you can duplicate multiple controls at the same time. So imagine I have a row of uh, controls here, like this, and I intend to um, I intend to have an additional row of these controls, um, but I don't want to have to go through and create each one of these individually. I can select all of them by touching each one individually. Now that they're all selected, I can click the duplicate button, and now three new controls were added, and they're settings will be exactly the same as the other three that were selected. And now um, now that they've been added to the design I can do further modification if I need to or I can just leave them as is. Um, so that covers duplication of controls. Thanks for watching. Bye.